Oh, welcome back to Rob's Homemade. Here I am in the workplace. And I'm here today, today, here, 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 for a hot sauce review. We have Mr. Steve Cooley. We all know I'm a big fan of Mr. Daddy Cools. Today we have Jalape Jalapeno. End of the line. It's the end of the line. When we barely know you know it. End of the line. Sorry about that. Uh, I'll stop now. Um, yes, jalapeno, end of the lime, uh, heat level mild, so we all know um, it's going to be, it's going to be tasty, I know it is, but it's not going to be spicy, so I'm looking forward to this, I really am, I've not had a mild sauce, I've, I normally have quite spicy ones, but this one, ingredients, jalapeno is 31%, green bell peppers 16%, onion, spirit vinegar, sugar, cucumber water, Oh, is it cucumber? Oh, cucumber and then water, sorry. Lime juice, 2.4%. Coriander hemp powder, 0.7. Olive oil, sea salt, black pepper, and xanthan gum. So, all good stuff. I'm looking forward to the uh, kick of the lime. I do like citrus in my stuff, you know I do. My drinks, my sauces. So, what else we got? Suggested uses. Creates a zingy salad dressing. That's, that could be good. Um, mixed with olive oil and lemon juice, splash on nachos, vegan pasta, rice dishes, and even added to your tequila. Ooh, tequila. Mm. Might have to get me a little bottle. I know you're a big fan of tequila. I might have to get me just a small bottle just to try it in tequila. Uh, obviously, Daddy Cool's pepper sauce, Facebook, Chili Dad. Um, so, yeah, let's uh, have a go. Like I said, we all know I'm a big, massive fan of Daddy Cool's. Makes awesome products every time, cracking. So we're having a bit of an amateur. Gonna give it a nice, you can smell the jalapeno, really strong. I'm hoping I've got a spoon in my pocket. And you know what, always carry a spoon. It's a small one, so it'll have to do. The bell pepper, onion, is there a bit of garlic in there, did I say? No, no garlic, it must be the, the onion. I'm gonna give it another quick shake. Oh, yes. So, Daddy Cool's jalapeno, end of the lime. Show you the pour reasonably thick not too thick so cheers mm. nice hit of pepper the limes kicking in and a little bit of heat around the mouth on the tongue <clears throat> it's a nice starting point this is for a non chili head or somebody who wants to get into spice that would make a cracking as he suggested salad dressing all day long or mix with some sour cream <coughs> excuse me mix with some sour cream put on your nachos mm. you can even taste that bit of cucumber in there mm lime in there the coriander as well just a little hint in the background that's really good that'd be an everyday use sauce for me i'd probably bring this to work <clears throat> whatever pasty i've got steak bake vegetarian cheese and onion and pour some of that that's really really good absolutely excellent i'm not going to give it a heat rating because it's a mild sauce, but if I was going to give it a heat rating, I'd give it a one or a two, which is what it's supposed to be. It's not It's not designed to be <clears throat> blow your mind, wreck your brain, have you in pain sauce. Like some of his other products, his Triple X Bad Boy, um, his Reaper Ketchup is... If you've never tried Daddy Cool's Catch the Reaper, 
get yourself a bottle. I guarantee you, if you're a bit of a chili head like me, or a massive chili head, you will never ever use any other ketchup. So yeah, really good, absolutely outstanding. Flavor, taste, great. Nine out of 10. For the end of the lime, jalapeno hot sauce from Mr. Steve Cooley, Daddy Cool. So I just want to leave that there. Excellent sauce, excellent, excellent. So I just want to say thank you very much for watching. Smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I will be back very, very soon. Peace.